Hey guys, and today I'm going to be reviewing the book Just As Long As We're Together and it's a book by Judy Bloom and the summary of this book is Rachel and Stephanie have been BFFs forever but then Allison moves in. Allison is cool, funny, and likable and instantly everybody likes her, especially Stephanie. How can Rachel compete with this? Rachel knows Stephanie is hiding something big and she wants to know what it is. Best friends don't keep secrets from each other. But now, it turns out that Stephanie is counting on Rachel more than ever. So, what I liked about this book was, I liked how they included family drama into one of these typical friendship novels, like Just Jane. That was a typical novel, and it didn't include anything other than, you know, the main core bits. They didn't add on anything that makes it more entertaining for the reader. Now, adding on too much would be bad, but I think they added the just right amount of layers to the book. And I think that this book was far more realistic than other books related to this. It talks about things in a way that aren't exactly like the Just Dream and all the other friendship books out there because in Just Dream, her best friend ends up coming back to her and the likelihood of that happening is pretty low in real life. I feel like a really good friend would have done that. But based on some of the stuff that she said to Jane earlier, I don't think it would have happened. Um, and I think they conveyed the pain that the characters were feeling very well. And they conveyed the emotions very well. Um, but what I did not like is that I think that it should have been like different in a more unique way with the storyline. Because... In a lot of friendship novels, it's like these two friends that are together, and then a third friend comes somehow, like, moving in or something, and steals one friend away from the other, and they resolve it somehow. And I think that that wasn't a very good thing to do, that to make it this storyline, because the story had a lot of potential with it, but they decided to go for the same old boring storyline instead of something that could have been really cool and creative but I overall really liked it I would give it a 7 out of 10 because I count a lot of my my percentage or ranking based on how good the storyline is and this storyline kind of faltered a little bit but I think this book was overall a really good book and I think that you should read it um be sure to leave a like and subscribe and if you have any books that you'd like me to review, please comment down below. Thank you so much. Bye.